To start with, open your Upwork account on browser. Click Track Time with the desktop app on your feed. It is found at the right part of your screen. Next, download your desired version of the app. Make sure that the version of the app fits in your unit. The app is also available for Mac OS X and Linux. Below, you can see the benefits when using the app for freelancers like you. The Upwork Time Tracker desktop app only works on Windows 7 and higher. When you're ready, click Download Upwork Desktop App and install it on your unit. I already got mine so I won't install again. Haha. <laughs> Let's go to the next part of this tutorial. As you can see on the screen, this is how the Upwork Time Tracker desktop app looks like. Here is the time on your current session. Here is your current contract with your employer. When you turn this on, it will start recording time and take screenshots automatically. Let's go to the work diary to let you see how it works. As you can see, this was the last screenshot taken. This is how your work diary looks like. Instead of manually logging in, you can use the Upwork Time Tracker desktop app to automatically log in and take screenshots every after 10 minutes of your current session. Let's try using this app. As you can see here in your work diary, the screenshots were automatically taken every after 10 minutes of the time. Let's go to the app. Here is the time I consumed within this week. This indicates the maximum time that I can use every week according to my contract. You can also add more details in your work by adding memo. You can turn on a reminder for this one. But in my case, I won't because my employer didn't really require one. Hee <laughs> hee. But let's just say, sort everything in the spreadsheet. Reminder, things like that. Bahala na ko daho malaki na ko, lol. Let's say for example, you're tired and you forgot to turn off the time tracker while browsing on your Facebook feed. Oh no. Don't worry. You can choose to delete the screenshot but the app only gives you 5 seconds. You can press delete and get back to work like nothing really happened. Good job, lol.